Registered. I change the air filter. Air filter done. Have to replace the air box at some point. It's got two tech screws instead of the right clips. And we're ready to fire it up and go for a drive. Here we are. About to do the first drive. Um, done everything. Oils, air filter, fuel. Um, I haven't done the fuel filter yet. Um, I'll probably do that when I get home. But this is the uh, first drive and hopefully it gets me all the way home. We've got about an hour of drive. Um, yeah, Let's see how we go. Going along well. But, uh, might be blowing a bit of shit out the pipes. But got plenty, plenty of go. Let's have a fairly tall diff in it too, I'd say. No, no taco, so I can't tell on the revs, but it just sounds sounds like it's probably got a 292 or something like that in it, so maybe even taller than that. The third gear doesn't really like doing 50. I'm in the 50 zone at the moment. It's like it wants to go back to second almost. A lot lighter clutch than I'm used to with the trophy. But I can get used to that. Guys there filling sandbags. Uh, pretty, a lot of floods at the moment. And yeah, people, people filling sandbags to bag up their houses, shops, whatever. Potholes to dodge on these roads. Normally, you know, the troopy because it sits so high, you can see everything a lot better. This is a bit weird being so low, you can't really see the potholes till you get pretty close to them.
rattly exhaust. Um, everything else seems to be driving fine. So, stopped over, a bit of a walk around and look, make sure it's good. Dropping a bit of water out of the header tank. Hopefully it's good enough to get back. Better keep moving. Back home in the shed, um, out with the kitchen cleaner. Uh, just going to clean up the engine bay a bit. Try and get rid of all these yucky bits of muck spread about. Just a general tidy up to try and get it look a bit neater.
using a using an old toothbrush, trying to yeah get right down in, get all along the thigh just trying to remove any grime, try and get it as neat as I possibly can. I find I find once you get a car super clean once, it's then easy to keep it clean. So thought I'd show you that. Worth a while, worth a while. It's equivalent to spend a full day on it. It's the only the same as watching a few movies. So why not do it I say? <laughs> Coming up pretty good compared to what it was. And once I've done it this way, I'll also then use degreaser and give it another pressure wash, car wash or something. And um, have a look then. Until then, I won't bore you with any more of this. And I'll just get stuck back into it. It's just another little thing I do. Doing this sort of thing. Garden sprayer. Normal 12 litre garden pump. It's filled with fresh water. I'm using degreaser or whatever cleaning product you're using. Kitchen cleaner, whatever. So you can still do it in the shed. Yeah, you drop a bit of water on the ground, but bugger all. It gives you enough pressure. You can actually use it. Give it a quick clean off. I find it works treat. Anyway, getting there with it slowly. <laughs> 